healing the community and food. You know, people talk about they can't get good outdoor food. Well, this is good. I don't want to call it fast food because it's not fast food. No, there's nothing know? fast about it yeah. but the service. <laughs> exactly, because, you know, uh, uh, Jeopardy say uh, food with no, of no nutrition, and they said fast food. That's what they said. And this right here got a lot of nutrition, so, you know, that was, that's what Jeopardy said about fast food. I think was, was the, the, the question was, so tell us, how can we come and what can you do for us? How can you feed us? Well, it's simple. Cousin Spider's Caribbean Restaurant is located in downtown Plainfield. It's at 211 West Front Street. It's between Park and Madison Avenues, and um, there's ample parking on South 2nd Street in the rear, which is free. And we've been there for two, a little over two years. Wow, wow. We came on in June. 10th, 2006. Okay. Uh -huh. We had a two year, two year anniversary, and through keeping the faith yes. and believing and trusting mm -hmm. that we are doing an integral uh, part in the community, yes, yes, yes. that we will continue to be there. And let, let me inject this right here, and I, and I like to, uh, uh, the people in the audience to hear the church and everybody else that not only do you get fed there, but it's a cultural journey. Yes, it because is. Because it's such beautiful artwork. Yes, yes, it is. It is. Such beautiful artwork. So it's a healing, you understand, mm -hmm. you know, a healing and a willing. Yeah. <laughs> Can we get away with that right there? Okay, so it's a healing and a, and a nutritious thing all in one. Yes, it's the ambiance. Yes. The, uh, the tropical colors. Yes. Uh, the Caribbean food. Yes. Uh, the attitude of yes. the owners, yes. mm -hmm. uh, our staff, yes. the delicious food yes. that's always prepared, that's prepared fresh. And the ginger beer. Of course. The ginger beer. Come on, you that can't. don't come from a bottle. <laughs> no way. If you like a bottle, you can get bottled. No. But ginger beer brewed homemade is yes. always the best way. Yes. And yes. I have to echo what Cynthia said earlier about feeding the mind because we do have a lot of different foods that will nourish your mind. They are all omega type uh, foods which consist of fish. Yes. That's always prepared fresh. It's mm. never cooked and laid to the hungry. side. <laughs> we have salmon which is always filled with omega 3s. And we have kingfish and it's always done different ways. Yes. Mm -hmm. We can have you can have a brown stewed with a gravy brown with vegetables, you can have it steamed with vegetables, you can have escovitched, lightly fried with uh, sauteed vegetables, a little pepper, scotch bonnet, and you can have it broiled, <coughs> grilled, roasted. We have a lot of fresh, fresh uh, vegetables that we continue to uh, place in our menus, and we always, always cater, we always cater We've been catering for a while. We've catered to various churches, sure. uh, various uh, universities, such yeah. as Princeton and Rutgers University. Wow. Mm. Tax a John. Good meal for them. Well, that's, yes, yes. My friend uh -huh. John Ombrister. Yes, 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 Tax yes, John. Yes, I love them, catered yes. to them at First mm -hmm. Park Baptist, my church, Shiloh Baptist Church. Okay. Various, various folks we have catered to. We've had a lot of networking parties. Mm -hmm. Um, we've done a lot of uh, social events there at Cousins Finest. Uh, we deliver. We do a whole gamut of things that we would hope the community will appreciate sure. and will continue to come out to Cousins. And we have a website which is www.cousinscaribbean.com. Mm -hmm. Our phone number is 908. 822-1212, again, 908-822-1212. Our fax number is 908-822-0020, again, 908-822-0020. We're in the telephone directory, okay. so there is no way you can miss Cousins Finest Caribbean Restaurant. Sure. Just look outside on it. We're in the newly developed Union County yes, Plaza. Yes, yes, we yes. sit in a little bit, but if you look you'll see the Dr. Bird in the window is always lit up. I trust that folks will come down because we cannot continue to be in the community to help the community uh, if folks don't come down to support us. Uh, let me ask you this right here. Um, I know you say that you cater, and I remember uh, I was talking to some 
women a few years ago that was, you know, struggling on what kind of work that they would get into. Yes. And they all were good cooks. I said, you know, do you, why you don't do like, uh, uh, um, like meals, you know, where you, did, you drop the meals off, deliver the meals to people's house, you know what I mean? Meals so, on wheels? Meals on wheels. Okay, there you go. Yes. There you go. And, and I was wondering, do you guys do something like of that? Of course. Okay. Of course we can do that. So they can order, let's say they order the whole week. Let's say they call it Monday or, what, or Saturday for the whole week. Yes. Where you can go Monday, Tuesday, and just deliver the meal. Because yes, you know we what? Can do that. And, and let me say this right here uh, uh, to the listening audience. You know, some of our jobs are so demanding today that we really, you know, don't have time to put that sojourn into cooking. Exactly. You know, and so the idea is that uh, uh, to have a restaurant where you can go and you can trust that the food is fresh and, and wholesome and, and healthy, that you can order your meals for a month where they will be delivered to you. Oh, sure. And that right there is a good thing. Oh, yes, you know, it is. Yes, it is. Because that, therefore, you're not, uh, uh, you know, uh, getting stuff that's pre, you know, whatever the case, you know. Prepackaged, so, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Just give us advance notice and we can put together something. We yeah. can always do that. And we can always accept corporate accounts. And um, we're there for the community. And we are hoping and praying that com the community is there for us. Okay. Well. And uh, we are hoping to be there for a very long time. So please come and consider Cousins Finest Caribbean Restaurant. Uh, the chef who's on call all day is Ray Garvey, and mm -hmm. he's always there to prepare and put love and, and, and joy into the food yes. that he prepares. And as somebody who has eaten some of that food, let me testify that it is a joyous experience. The food is prepared by loving hands, and it is absolutely fabulous. Thank you, Daddy G. Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay, and do uh, you have anything at this moment that what about cakes do you have any you guys do cakes uh, we do cakes we do homemade cakes we do red velvets it, if you're familiar i know there are a lot of southerners out there that uh have eaten red velvet cake i've had red velvet cake yeah. years ago yes i have had that a long time oh yes and it's mm -hmm. scrumptious yeah. we do carrot cake sometimes the cheesecake uh, we do uh, potato pudding, okay. uh, cornmeal pudding, sweet potato pies. Uh -huh. We've had chocolate cake. Now, do you do the uh, do, do you do the short uh, dish sweet potato pie? Oh yes. Oh, oh yes. Right? Yes, and uh -huh. we do our, our famous, which is okay. always good. I think he's falling in love with your food right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh well, yes, it comes. Come, come, come down right. again. <laughs> no, no, I like the short dish. I'm yeah, my mother used to make the short dish. She made the short dish. She never made the tall one for me. Y'all make the short dish, you know. And I'm yeah. always famous black Jamaican uh, fruit cake. It's a lot of fruit that's grind, uh, blended together in a fruit process and press food processor, and um, it's good eating. It really is. And folks need to come down. You need to come down, man. Come on down. Come on down. Come on down. Come on and down. If you don't, you don't know what you're missing. Exactly. Cynthia, you want to say a few words? We got about a minute left. You want anything you have to say to end this? Yes, if you are a potential business owner or a current business owner and you need some ideas as to how to make money for your business, whether you're for-profit or non-profit, give me a call at Cynthia Jewell Marketing and Public Relations Agency. My number is 973-736-0853. Again, that number is 973-736-0853. Well, um, yes, the, uh, I mentioned before that uh, uh, Solaris wants another $160 million in bond financing. Uh, the state board that considers that is going to be meeting on Thursday of next week, a week from today, in Trenton at 10 in the morning. Uh, and uh, the Restore Muhlenberg Coalition is meeting Monday at 6.30 at the Ducre School of Art, 1030 Central Avenue. Uh, to plan what we're going to do um, with that issue. Okay, now, you know, next week we want to uh, bring all everybody in uh, uh, that's worked with the, um, the Millenberg thing, the, the campaign to, to keep the hospital open. So all are welcome. That's and, a lot of people. Well, you know. That's just, a lot all, of people, then. You know, bring, you know, uh -huh. bring the, the keys, you know, the key. And the some way. of them will be down in Trenton, I'm sure, that day, because that's the day of the hearing. Okay. On okay. that bond financing. Okay. Well, try to get someone in here. If um, we can. Okay. We will try. All right. We're about at the end. Are we at the end, Melissa, of the show? Okay. We are at the end. And again, 
don't forget a November 4th, uh, you know, vote Democrat. Absolutely. May God be with you. Good night.